Hi guys! Right, well, I'm sure you've all been waiting for this video. I'm just getting comfy here. I've literally just walked through the door. Um, haven't even made myself a drink yet. <laughs> Excuse my appearance, it's hot out there. As you all know, um, I sprained my ankle a couple of weeks ago and it's feeling it today. But it was worth it. Well, I'm hoping it was worth it because here it is. I have I've literally, honestly, no word, I've literally just walked through the door. Um, I've just gone and got my little tiny scissors so that I can get into this. <sighs> yeah, <laughs> out of breath. Just done with my scissors. All right, let's get this bad boy open, shall we? For those of you that don't know what this purple package is, where have you been? This is from Heaven and Earth Designs. Um, it's I treated myself to a full material pack. I normally just download the uh, PDF file and put it onto Pattern Keeper, and I normally kit it up myself using Lakeside Needlecraft, and they are absolutely great. I've kitted two of my project projects up. Oh, sorry, I'm talking a bit because I'm really excited. Sorry, <laughs> right? Yeah. So Heaven and Earth Designs. Uh, I treated myself back in February. And because they're quite a small business and they do that personal touch, there is a bit of a wait. Um, so yeah, February the 16th, I officially ordered it. It was <clears throat> just after my birthday, so I thought I would treat myself. Mm, the first little snip. This is where this will go drastically wrong, probably. <laughs> oh, right, let's get into you. Right, first snip. I'm tempted just to rip it, but I don't want to ruin this beautiful package because I am going to um, keep it because I won't. I'm torn on whether to start this because, for those of you that know me relatively relatively well, um, I don't really like to have more than one project on the go. But I'm doing. As you know, I'm doing John Enright Deep Blue Sea. And there's a lot of blue, shall we say. Um, so I'm tempted to have two projects on the go just so that I can get away from doing nothing but blue for a little while. Switch between the two. You'll see why in a minute, uh, in what I mean. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if I can zoom you out because I am I have got the camera oh sorry I have got the camera so that it's I can see what's going on let me see if I can tilt you a little bit oh, it don't matter. <laughs> all right we're in actually grab first let's get this you don't need to see that that's my that's for me that's my invoice Nothing exciting there. <laughs> Just reminded me how much money I spent, but it's worth it. Ooh. Right, so I don't know if this is going to be backwards. I'm sure it will be because it's a bit like mirror image. But what I'll do is I will put a picture of everything that was in the lovely purple package um, on my Facebook group, uh, All Things Cross Stitch, Royal Stitcher. So yeah, first reveal is oh, this is what i'm going to be doing let me see if i can get the first page out of this plastic thing let's get rid of the glare i'm sure you figured what it is oh the paper feels lovely um I, I am doing this off of pattern keeper but i thought if i'm going to treat myself i might as well get a hard copy officially from um the actual site from the actual company so there we go guys and this is what I'm going to be doing and it's Alexandra V back and it's called mother of dragon I'm pretty sure that is backwards <laughs> um, let me just try something quickly let me just try and get you in properly. There we go. 
so there she is in all her glory that is what I'm going to be doing switch back Ooh, <laughs> the paper feels amazing <laughs> getting excited over paper people <laughs> we know we're obsessed with paper when we get obsessed with paper so yeah in this little pack is the um the floss basically what you would get if you printed off your own copy anyway uh, so you get your floss floss usage chart etc etc i'm not going to get it out because i don't want to break any rules with regards to showing you the design but there is a fair few pages does it tell me how many pages uh 84 pages so i should say that six of those is probably you know the beginning bit with your your floss codes and floss usage and of course that lovely front page so that's going to stay in there for a little bit that's the first big guys try not to drag this out because i don't want it to be too long and tedious oh wow I am doing it on um, Easy Count 20, uh, yeah, Fabric Brand Easy, Thread Count 25, and the size is 25 by 34. So let's open this up. Oh. <laughs> I'm sure you would prefer to be angled down a little bit so you can actually see what I'm doing. Let me flick you down a little bit. Excuse my seating position. I'm just, like I say, I've got my leg up because my ankle is absolutely agony. Oh, sorry for making you a little bit dizzy. Oh, right, there we go. Right, so, like I say, this is the... Oh, I ripped it. I'm not one to keep these things. I'm sure plenty of you are screaming at the video saying, don't rip it, keep it. But I'm sorry, no, I'm too excited. <laughs> It's only fabric, but I won't be using this again. My partner will kill me if I start hoarding material. So, there we have it. It's not too big, actually. I thought it would... Well, actually, I suppose it is. <laughs> so, yeah, it's it's that and double. Ooh. Right. Oh, and they've done the edging as well. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see whether I can show you what I mean. You know, like when you get it, it all starts fraying. They've already pre-sewn it for me. So I don't have to deal with that. <clears throat> so that's my 25 count. Easy guide. I'll build up that. go that's that let's bung that over here and see what else oh no hang on sorry let's bung it in here oh, come on that's it close that back up um i'm doing a there's a, a facebook group that i'm on that's called um oh no let me quickly have a look see what it's called <sighs> You'd think I'd be prepared, but like I say, I've literally just walked through the door. Um, let's have a look. Uh, la, 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 la. Sorry, bear with me, guys. Um, Facebook. All right, it's a Facebook group, group and it is called... I should know this by now. Um, Zoom Stitchy Friends. Um, if you join the group... We like. I know that um, Liv, who is the admin of that group, she would obviously prefer active users. So if you are going to be joining, please be as active as you possibly can. Um, join the Zoom. Basically, the Zoom. I'm on the 18th, which is Saturday, a week on Saturday, um, the 18th of this month, June. Um, I'm gonna possibly do a new start and do this new start so that's if i can hold off till then <laughs> i'm sure i can i've been patient to, so far to actually get this 
but yeah, um, maybe join and come and join us on the Zooms. It's literally like a little stitch with me, so all right, what we have here. This is an extra little goodie, I believe, because I did literally just order the um, the floss, the fabric and the chart. So this is a little added bonus. Ooh. Oh, that's pretty. Never had one of these before. Let's get you, come on, behave yourself. As I said, I'm going to take pictures anyway of the stuff and put it onto my um, Facebook group, which is, again, all things cross-stitch. So, is this magnetic? No, not quite. But I'm sh it's a needle threader. Now, I don't use needle threaders, as you know. Um, I tend to just put the floss between my fingers and then run the needle down and it catches it. But this could come in handy. We'll see. I might use it still. <clears throat> or I might try and get a magnet for it to stick to and have it on my design. As, as on my project sorry as I'm stitching it I'm going to be stitching it royal rose um and the fabric that I've, uh, the floss that I've got was the one over one pack so I am going to be doing full crosses with this I have been doing it with um have been stitching recently with um use your word valley with tent stitch oh and we ha also have little needle now I don't know if I will use this because I am loving the ball tip needles so this will just get stuck it's a bit crooked to be honest but <laughs> I don't know if that's my eyes anyway so yeah a needle I did not pay for that so that was a nice little added bonus from them in this lovely little bit like velvet a velvet bag and keep that keep them safe Ooh, come on in your pop there we go Bum that there and then the piece de resistance is the floss oh, oh wow it's a lot of free 10 guys <laughs> now this is what i mean with my i don't like multiple projects however because this has so much black, I'm tempted to um, start this. Like I said, I might start it on the 18th. Um, and then I can switch out. I've got two frames anyway, so it's not like I'll have to take them off the frame and put them on. I've got two frames, so I can always take the frame off my stand, replace it with the other one. So yeah, I think I am going to start this on the 18th. On my on the uh, the Zoom call that I'm going to be doing. I do out of interest. I want to see. Let me just take it off this one. I want to see how long the the thread is. Do I need to be snipping it? I think I do. Yeah. So that's something that I'm going to be looking at doing before the 18th. Then. <clears throat> um. I'll have a little look at other people's videos and see what they do. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to just snip there because that's on the hoop. That'll be on the hoop, the little hoop. Um, I'll see whether I can get away with just snipping there because it's one over one. If I snip there, it'll be double that length. Will it? Yeah. So I might, might be able to just do that. But I'll research that before I get snip happy. <laughs> I don't want to be ruining it straight away. Um, I have been using, I've recently put my Deep Blue Sea onto Annie's Keepers. Oh, let me see if I can quickly show you. Because it is right here. Oh, excuse the view, people. Right, here's my Annie's Keepers that I've been using for my Deep Blue Sea. I've got them on this big ring that my partner sorted for me 
don't ask me what size because I haven't got a clue and I haven't got a tape measure handy to be able to tell you. Um, so yeah, I've been using Annie's Keepers. Well, I'm lying. I was using floss cards and I've recently put them onto these. <clears throat> but with this, I'm just going to keep using. I'm just going to use these. I'm not going to faff about putting them all on Annie's Keepers because as you can see, there's these plastic hoops. They're quite sturdy and um, the actual floss chart it's laminated so it's not like the cardboard papery stuff that you can get with some some other kits which is great but i don't particularly like them i find that it frays the the fabrics when you <clears throat> when you release them so i think i'm just going to keep keep these as, as is and there we have it guys uh how many colors let me just out of interest i can't remember <laughs> It was so long ago that I ordered it. Uh, let me have a look. The chart contains 86 colours, people. So, there we have it. Oh, there you go. Chucking it all over the place. So, that can... Like I say, I'll have a look about what I'm going to do with the floss, cutting-wise, before I get cut happy and then regret it. So, yeah, as I said, it's being stitched on that 25 count easy guide. Um, I'm going to be using my Royal Rose method. If you're not sure what I'm yabbering about when it comes to Royal Rose, um, I have a video on the channel. I believe it's the previous video to this. Uh, let me tilt you back up a little bit. Oh, sorry guys. Such a novice at this. <laughs> um, but yeah, there you go. <laughs> that lovely purple package. So I'm going to put it all back in here, uh, I'm going to do a little bit of research about my floss, um, how I'm going to cut it, see whether we can just literally snip the bonds, so I don't have to take them off, put them on, put them back on again. Right, well, I hope you enjoyed that as much as me, it was worth the stress and the pain, because as I said, my ankle... Poor, my poor poor ankle let me see if i can get you off of here and show you it